Mike Peden here with Luke Scott, De La Salle Senior, if I'm correct. And uh, so I guess the st classic storybook ending, you end your high school career with another championship. That's all you could ask for. That's, that's the best feeling you can have. Win another championship, be in the legendary book at De La Salle and in, the, and in state. It's the best feeling I can have. What did Dave tell you? I looked over there when he subbed you out, and you guys were hugging for, it seemed like, 30 seconds a minute. It was like he just, it, 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 it was like he, that youth, <laughs> youthful energy we saw a year ago return uh, for that long period. I, I couldn't breathe. I couldn't, that was the biggest bear hug I've ever given in my life. My ribs felt like they just cracked, and he was trying to talk to me, and I had a mouth guard in my mouth. I couldn't say a word to him. <laughs> It was funny. You're going to take x-rays tomorrow? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah. Talk about just his impact and his leadership as a coach. He's won a lot of state titles, but announcers, everybody I talk to, they have nothing but praise for the guy. And as we've seen, he's a very strong coach, but when he's excited, like I said, he displays the same youth that you guys do. Well, he's the best coach I've ever had, probably ever will have. He honestly has one of the games in state the first game my mind wasn't there and he put me right back on track and now we're state champions and tell me first half it was tight De La Salle then got a few turnovers they forced 12 in the first half and that led to 17 points how did you get on that run because that really was the difference in this one well yeah that's all we're about we're about pressure and playing defense as hard as we can and as for as long as we can 36 minutes and that's what we did tonight turnovers and points now you left a few Austin fans unhappy about the lack of a shot clock. Uh, of course, though, you play within the strategy, so just how do, you, how do you keep that discipline? Because a lot of times we see schools, they play those longer possessions, and then they start getting into a lapse. Uh, you guys just kept passing the ball around, and there was no flinching. Well, Thorson was just, he coached us up on that. He's like, why would you, you want to force anything if you're up by 15? And if you're, if you're up by 15 and you can just pass the ball around and they're not guarding you, so be it. We're winning. Well, you won't have that at the next level. You're going to have to shoot the ball at least every 35 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> Speaking of, uh, where are you going from here? I have uh, a couple offers from I have offers from a school in Texas called St. Edwards, and then I have Crookston, and then I have other schools like Jamestown, and Valley City State, and Hillsdale, and all those schools. Well, I can give you some history with St. Edwards. That's where uh, Taj McWilliams Franklin attended college. She played for the Minnesota Lynx, of course, won a title. So. Uh, <laughs> There's the some, <laughs> the, yeah, the link, you know. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> what are you gonna miss most about this? Probably just the camaraderie of the team and Thorson, and just getting excited for a basketball game. The crowd was amazing tonight. Just everything about it. How chilling is that, and to see an overflow crowd like that, where they had to go to the upper deck. That's that's all you want in a state tournament. That is the best thing you could ask for. To be, have a crowd that large in a high school game, that, I mean, that's that's what I wanted at least. Last question. Anyone you want to say hi to that's watching this? Mom. Hello, Mom. <laughs> You've got some other media, so I'll let you uh, take care of those folks. But thanks, Luke Scott, and congratulations Thank again. You. Thank you.